You might know that we use the new tech TriCaster here in our video studio at Rackspace to switch between our three video cameras. And we're not the only ones. Uh, Leo Laporte has one of these TriCasters and uh, lots of professionals around the world use TriCasters to broadcast video out. But today, uh, they have something in a backpack and we're gonna see it right now. So who are you? Hi, I'm Philip Nelson with New Tech, yeah. and I'm the Chief Relationship Officer. And uh, you know, I work with a lot of our interesting and cool clients at New Tech, and I'm really excited to be here with you today. Yeah, for people who don't know, because you're always behind the scenes at, on the video shows, you, you make the switchboard, or, or how do you define it really? Well, it's not really a switcher anymore. Well, you know, TriCaster is a, a live production system. But I have, we have something cool because in, historically when people think of live television, they think of lots of equipment, difficult to set up, very time consuming and hard to use. Yeah. And one of the things that we're trying to do at New Tech is make it democratize live TV so that it's now accessible to everyone yeah. and people with great stories and great ideas can get their message out to the world. So, so, so you got one in your backpack. Well, I'm going to do something that's kind of unorthodox here today. I know you've got the new sweet iPhone 6, yeah. and I know it probably has a timer Ain't on it, it right? It's a glorious big iPhone. Of it is. It's glorious. It really is. Yeah, there but is a you know, timer here. So what, I, what I'm going to do... So you want me to set this timer up? Yeah, I want you to set the timer up, and All you right. can do a, you, you can count up. They're not yet. I'll tell you when to start. But we are going to go basically show people how fast you can set up a live television studio and be ready to do a show. So this is aimed at the new kind of GoPro kind of uh, videographer who needs to go to the top of Whistler and film a little sh show or allowing go to the consumer people, electronics show. Uh, and allowing people to better communicate, you know, wherever they may be. Yeah. That's, that's one of the goals. So you ready? So let's start the clock. Yay. So uh, I've come in with two bags. The clock is running. So I'll start off by tearing off this little piece of tape, and this is the TriCaster Mini. Oh. And so in this backpack is everything I need to do a live television show. All right. And first of all, we'll start out with the beautiful TriCaster Mini. Yeah. And you'll notice that with the TriCaster Mini, it actually has HDMI inputs, because there's so many cameras you can get at Best Buy or wherever that um, are HDMI. And so we just wanted to make it very easy for people to... Uh, Including to, the GoPros, right? Yeah, you so can you use can the GoPros. you can put three GoPros in there. That's so yeah, that's exactly what you can about do. About 300 bucks a piece, right? So now you're up to $1,000. How much is this going to run? This, uh, this starts at um, just under six grand. Under six grand. Yes. And I see one, two, three, four inputs. Yes, four inputs. And two video outs. Yep. So you can have two monitors. Or a, a monitor and a live video out. Does it compress out for the internet? Yeah, I mean the TriCaster in general allows you to go to live web. Um, you know, it allows you to go out to video screens, and it allows you to uh, record and stream. So you know, uh, you know, uh, the things that you love about your TriCaster are available Should here. Should I click uh, launch TriCaster? Yes, please. Thank yeah. you. You're my trusty assistant now. Yeah. All right. So I can still run Microsoft Windows. <laughs> I don't GoPro, like to get the, get the GoPro. Oh, shoot! Sorry. So uh, <laughs> I'm I'm falling down on the job. I'm the camera guy too. So here. this is I, I'm actually going to kind of take this up a notch in what we're going to do in our show, and uh, so now how are we doing on our time, Robert? Two minutes, almost two minutes here. One fifty. Okay. So now I've I've pretty much set up the TriCaster. It's launching, but in my five minutes, I'm going to do something even more. I'm going to not only set up the TriCaster, but I'm going to set up the studio as well. So oh, here we have a, uh, a nice green screen. So we're going to set up a little chroma key for you. All right. There's Rocky in the background running our old TriCaster. What's the TriCaster he has, by the way? What's the TriCaster what? He has a TriCaster 455, I think. 455. Yes. Let's hope I have enough space here. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Look at that, a green screen. 
I, you, you didn't tell me that not to wear a green shirt today. I should have. Fortunately, you're not wearing day glow green, so we're, we, can, we may be okay. Yeah. So next, I've got a camera. So you see that I have the GoPro there, but I also have a, another camera. Because it's HDMI, you can use you know, just about any camcorder that you can find at your local retailer yep. and uh, integrate that into your live show. Uh, let's see, local drive TriCaster Mini. Alright. I don't know what there we go. So how are we doing on time, Robert? Uh we're at three twenty-three right now. That's not bad. Yeah. Setting up a TV studio used to take a few days, right? Yeah, it did, and a and a large crew of people. And now, you know, with two small bags that I just carried into your office, yeah. you know, I'm actually not only setting up the production system, which is the TriCaster, but I'm also setting up all the gear necessary to do our show you I actually I encourage you to try this at home I hear Rocky heckling from the background don't try this at home but now this this still requires uh, power right you do have to have electricity yeah. that's always a, a good thing when doing anything you could carry a small generator I guess you, you could oh, I, yeah you could how much memory is in here so that, how many hours can I record and um, keep on this? there's uh, there's two different versions of the TriCaster mini um, one is, uh, is 59 95 and it's 15 hours. So let's see, the last thing I have to do here is just plug in my cameras. How are we doing on time? 425. I think you're trying to go for under five minutes, aren't you? I am going for under five minutes. Yeah, you might make it. That's assuming nobody comes and offers you a beer at this time. Well, you know what? You haven't done that yet, so we're good. <laughs> You're lucky today. I don't have any beer. <laughs> All right. You got 10 seconds. And we're done. Ten we seconds. have officially set up a live television studio in awesome. less than five minutes. Awesome. You had five seconds to spare there, you know? So now we're launching the TriCaster. Yeah, now we just hit the five-minute mark. So what are we seeing here? Okay, so this is the interface of the TriCaster Mini. Um, and you'll see that one of the things that makes this system very unique is that we actually have a monitor on the side of the case. Yeah. So if you look here, um, let me put this cord behind it. So you'll see that we have the, the program monitor now on, yeah. the, on the case so we can actually see what's going out live. And um, we were looking at a, a, the TriCaster interface and you know, for anybody that's, that's that's not familiar with with a live production studio this 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 interface replaces millions of dollars of equipment in the olden days yeah so we have our computer monitors at the top so we can see our cameras we have our uh, the area in the middle is actually where we mix our videos we can select what's going to be displayed and at the bottom is our media players so the media players allow us to select some uh, transitions or, uh, or or video clips or graphics. Yep. But you know we can do basic video switching as 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 you would expect. We can do real time transitions. It also has the real time animated transition. So you'll see the New Tech animated logo wipe. So that's included. Also, we can bring in lower third graphics. So there's a lower third. Hey guys, I'm Philip Nelson. We're here at uh, Rackspace with Robert Scoble. So uh, we can bring in our lower third graphics, but we also can roll in pre-edited video clips so that you know, if we select um, you know, our video player, our media player, um, it has a virtual tape operator. So let's say we're talking about the adoption of iPad. You know, one of the things about, that we're trying to do with the TriCaster Mini is to allow businesses to take their communications from boring you know, talking heads to more dynamic television style presentation because we are all TV experts. Yeah. Your kid's a TV I'm expert. A TV. I, you are. You watched it since you were a kid. Yeah. You know, we all have, even, even people in business, they may not know why something looks like TV and something doesn't, but they know yeah. if it does. You and can so tell, you can sort of tell the difference when you're shooting on a little cell phone. Exactly. Camera. And, uh, and so, although it's soon, I bet you're going to take IP uh, video off of these cell phones and bring them in here and switch that would be back cool. and forth, you know. That would be but, cool. But you get a nice GoPro. I mean, you can see the video quality on a GoPro is really good. Oh, uh, yeah. You, even on your professional camera. Now, your professional camera is aimed at a green screen, right? Yes. Now, what, what so, we, let me bounce through this real quick. So, yeah. like, we can roll in our, our pre edited video clips. So, if we're doing an iPad or a tablet discussion, instead of just talking about it, I can actually roll in 
you know, video talking about how tablets all over the world are now being adopted or used in so many different areas. And I'm showing um, footage that gives me an example of, of tablet use. Then I can show, you know, animated graphics, which makes that corporate presentation look more like broadcast television, yeah. which is very important. And then we talk about global adoption of tablets and we roll graphics. But instead of just me sitting on camera talking, we now have a more dynamic presentation. Yeah. So um, the other thing we can do is we have uh, a technology called IVGA, which allows us to bring in um, a, the information from a remote laptop. Because I'm sure you've, you know, with what you do, I'm sure that you've seen a PowerPoint or two in your life. Of course. And I'm sure that most of them have put you to sleep, correct? They do. Anyways, you, okay. you, you, so, can, bring, you yes. can bring stuff from a yeah. laptop, from a camera. Yes, you can bring in remote sources yeah. from your laptop. If can you, you have airplay to this? Yes, you can. Oh, it, oh, we, oh. We, the TriCaster can actually, through IVGA, can come from Apple devices through AirPlay. It can come in through IVGA. You know, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, but we also have built-in virtual sets. So, you, you know, you saw this uh, green screen we have here. Yeah. Um, if I could get our lovely spokesmodel, Scott, to step in front of the green screen, I'd appreciate it. Yeah. Um, and you'll see that instead of just having a, uh, a, a guy sitting in front of a, uh, a computer talking, um, we can actually, um, we can put Scott in the virtual set. And you're gonna have to zoom out for me. There we go. Yeah. There we go. So now we have Scott in a virtual set, and I'm just going to go in and turn on um, uh, Live Mat, which will key Scott out. And what's cool is you'll notice on the edges there's some garbage because yeah. our green screen isn't wide enough. We can actually crop that out. So let me go back to uh, the left and crop the left side, and we're going to crop the right side. Wow. And now he's in that virtual set. Move and around a little bit, yeah. <laughs> What's cool is, is in our go. virtual sets, we can actually um, zoom in and out. Slow so down. I can actually, you know, I, we have a wide shot on the virtual set, and yeah. we can zoom in on the virtual set. Wow. We can zoom out to Scott. So you have this real-time control. So you can take, in five minutes of setting up a green screen and a camera and uh, some lights, we actually can look like we're in a million-dollar studio. Yeah, I remember when that 2020 showed me a studio that cost more than a million dollars to do just that. <laughs> oh, it's, it is amazing. So one other thing that we can do now that, that's in part of the TriCaster Mini, it's called holographic virtual sets. H have you ever shot a panoramic photo? Oh, yeah. Well, now you can import that panoramic photo into TriCaster and turn it into a real-time virtual set. So check this out. Uh -huh. So here we have the Eiffel Tower. This is just a panoramic photo shot in Paris. And watch this. We just scroll around that panoramic photo and there is Scott standing there in the courtyard. And we're really just standing here in front of this little small green screen in your studio. Wow. So any, anywhere you want to be, you can, you, you know, if you, you if you wanted to be at the iPhone store, Apple store, and you wanted to have that in the background of your your, your live webcast, you could. It's it's yeah. you know. But our goal is to to allow you know anyone with an important message to make it look like broadcast television and do it in the most portable and affordable way humanly possible. Uh, that's and really that's what cool. we have with the TriCaster Mini. Also, you know, it, like, as you mentioned at the very beginning, you can send your show out through HDMI to video screens, to projectors, you can stream or it out to, to the web. Uh, to or to a compressor for live streaming. You can, it also has built-in streaming and coding inside. Oh, does it? Yeah, so you what don't have to have that. What services does it support? Um, you can go to YouTube, Ustream, Akamai, we don't really care. We have a long list of pre-built-in um, you know, hosting awesome. sites. And then it also can do all the social media publishing so that you can share your show or clips from your show on YouTube or Facebook or Twitter. And then I want to show you one last really cool thing. This is cool. So uh, I'm going to uh, show you like how to tie all this together and kind of create a show. Yeah. So um, what we're going to do is um, we have a, a, a scripting, a macro or an automation technology where if you want to have something complicated in your intro, you can use just keyboard shortcuts to trigger a lot of events. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to trigger a, uh, a finale. So You'll see that we're at the TriCaster Mini around the world, and I'm gonna cue Scott in three, two, one, and you're live, Scott. Hi, everybody, welcome to Paris, France, home of the Eiffel Tower, where we're launching some great new technology. 
Hi, my name is Scott Carroll. Today we're launching the TriCaster Mini from Mutech, letting people around the world make better videos, tell their stories in creative and inspiring ways. So you're not going to want to miss it. Don't go anywhere. And thanks for joining us. So that was one keyboard shortcut that controlled my entire intro. So like in your intro, you could have it sequenced so that it triggers a bunch of things and then it cuts to a live shot. So in your intro every week or every day or however often you have guests, it's that shot from in here with your, your guests. So that yeah. guest is now integrated into the intro live. So this power is, is all built into this TriCaster Mini. And they start at $59.95. And uh, yeah, as the whole studio here you got. And so the TriCaster Mini is 6000 uh, GoPro cameras are uh, three hundred dollars right. each. The, all the cables, so monitor, hundred bucks or so. Laptop is uh, under a thousand now. That camera was a thousand. And how much were the lights? Um, four hundred like, like four or five hundred bucks. I mean, yeah. it. You can really build a really nice studio for well under ten k. Yeah. And do some amazing things. And so it is a cool time, you know, to be part of New Tech. And this ultra portability, I literally carried this onto the airplane today. Yeah. I brought an entire TV studio with me as, as carry-on luggage, and I checked the, the, the stands. So anywhere you want to go in the world, you have your show, and you're ready to go within five this minutes. This is awesome, man. This is really cool. It lets people uh, move around and do a lot more things. Uh, and a lot of shows now are done on ski slopes or mm -hmm. at CES. Exactly. You need to set up in 20 minutes and be done. Well, it took you five. So Five yeah. minutes. What's cool, though, Rocky is Rocky and I need to fight a little bit and have a beer, so that's, that's 20 minutes. Well, you know what's cool <laughs> is with the speed of setup, you could be set up, record your show, break down, and be gone before security arrives. Yeah. No, sorry. <laughs> Bad joke. We, we have hit that a, a few times. Apple's, Apple security didn't uh, yeah. like Scoble's it. Scoble's here. Scoble's here. Go, yeah. go, go. Yeah. Rocky, come on. Let's go. Let's record this and let's run. Get, get him out of the. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, this is a lot of fun. Um, yeah, this is cool. Well, dude, I appreciate you being <coughs> allowing us to come in and show this to and you. We're really excited. Thanks for helping us put it on our show because we're already using one of your older boards. Now, compared to the, uh, the uh, other products that you make, this is not uh, this is more portable, obviously. Way more portable. Um, if you are shooting on real high-end cameras, you probably want the older stuff, yes. right? You know, w the the TriCaster, we have a high-end professional line that uses more broadcast industry style connectors like HDSDI and Component HD. But you know, the TriCaster Mini is designed for you know businesses, for nonprofits, for schools, you know, or bloggers. Bloggers. I mean, yeah, people that have H HDMI grand. cameras and they can, you know, they don't have the space, they don't have the infrastructure, and with you know a very portable system, you're ready to roll in minutes. I think this is awesome. I think a lot of people are going to use it. So. Cool. We'll see you at uh, South by Southwest next year, and yes. probably Consumer Electronics Show too. Definitely CES. Yeah. Thanks, Robert. Thanks. Appreciate Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, by the way, where do we learn more about it? Um, you can learn more at www.newtechnewtech.com. Very cool. Thanks. Thanks, dude.